Hello friends, uh, welcome again and this is my new project petrol pump management system and uh, I have developed this project in PHP and MySQL the version I am using for the PHP is PHP version 7 and the MySQL version is 5.6 I am running this project on the Jamf server but if you have a WAMP server or the LAMP server then you can configure this project also there so there is no operating system restrictions means major desktop operating system just like if you are using the Linux operating system, means Ubuntu or Fedora, then you can configure this project also there. And if you are using the Mac operating system, then you can also run this project there on the Mac. Okay, so let's start with the uh, functionality. For front-end development, I am using the HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Some of the jQuery library also I have used, like uh, uh, form validations plugins and the date plugins and uh, drop down menu plugins and the side of plugins I have used uh, jQuery. So let's start with the functionality. So the project title is petrol pump management system and this is a mini project developed in PHP and MySQL. Okay, so this is the home page of the project. You can say this is a very simple and normal home page. Okay, this is the about us page. So about project page. So if you want to change and if you want to add more uh, information there then you can do it directly from uh, that php page about that php page this is the login page and this is the dynamic page so if you have the user id and password then you can uh, log inside the system without it you will not be able to access and turn on pages okay and uh, this user id and password will be uh, confirmed from the database <laughs> contact us page so this is the static page i am not saving the details of this contact us page anywhere into database so also i am not sending any type of messages or email from this page so you can treat it as a contact us page and as a static page okay so so the user id is admin and the password is test test this is the dashboard of the uh, admin means admin can perform these operations inside the project okay so the same menu is available also here on the top right the report section the administration section okay so i am going to form one by one this is the add employee section so if you can want to add the employee then you can add the employee here from here this is the add supplier section from here you will be able to add the supplier supplier of the petrol or the diesel or the cmg so you can add the supplier from here this is the add machine so if you want to add machine means the petrol pump machine then you can uh, add the machines from here and you can save the details and this is the add tanker so if tankers is coming then you can update the tankers from here right and this is the add cells from where you will be able to add the cells daily cells you can add means they start being in reading so this is the add forms from where you will be able to add the details of the uh, things okay so this is the report so you can see this is the employee report all of the employee which has been added by you will be displayed here also you can search the employee from here suppose if i am searching for the amit then i can search it right so if you click on the edit then you will be uh, edit the information from here right so you can see. okay if you want to delete then you can also delete the information from here this is the supplier report so all the supplier which you have added you will be able to uh, see here and you will be able to edit and delete the records from here also you can filter out sorry you can also uh, sort the records from here edit the records and delete the records from here <coughs> right okay so wait okay so next um, machine report so all of the machine which you have added will be displayed here right so this is added update right so all of the machine which you added will be displayed here right this is the tanker reports so all the tankers which is coming and if what is the quantity will be displayed here right so you can also edit and delete the records from here right this is the sales report so if uh, this is all about the sales report means what is the employee name what is the machine name a sales date and what is the start reading and end date in reading so you can uh, see the reports here and you can also edit and delete the records from here also you can add the cells from the front end panel this is the my account session so if you want to update your account details then you can update your account details from here this is a change password from where you will be able to change the password and the logout section so once you log out the above menu will not be displayed because admin will not be able to 
so non login user will not be able to see the above menus administration menu so let me show you so you can see the above menu is not coming because of admin uh, is not logging if admin gets logged inside the system then the above menu will be displayed right so this is all about the project petrol pump management system so if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment or whatsapp me or email me i will incorporate those changes inside this project and i will make this project according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest knowledge thanks for watching the video thank you very much